He's got diarrhea. Diarrhea. This is always funny to watch. Hold your ass, boy. <laughs> oh my god, I love that. I love it, it's bullets. I'll show you all. <laughs> love infinite ammo. In Metal Gear Solid 2, you start out at Solid Snake, making an awesome entrance onto a tanker. And Snake's here to sneak in and take pictures of the newest Metal Gear and upload them to Facebook. And what started out as a simple sneaking mission goes bad when Russians take out the crew and are after the new Metal Gear Ray. Identify yourself. And a bad situation goes worse when Ocelot shows up to blow up the place. And things just go horribly wrong. Metal Gear has always been about stealth, but now it focuses on camouflage and survival. This game will reward you for using stealth, but there are moments in which you have to fight, and CQC will be the most important thing you will use because it's so useful. One button handles tons of moves and ways to handle situations, but I personally like taking human shields. Taking out a tank before was really easy. Just toss grenades into the hatch, but now taking out a tank is much harder. Tanks are guarded by infantry, and you'll have to take down each soldier one by one. Once they're gone, the enemy commander shows up, and that's when the real fight begins. Attacks become more aggressive, and as you dodge cannon fire, trying to get close enough to kill him. But once you land that final kill shot, it leaves you with a good feeling, and a new toy. MGS4's gameplay is still about sneaking around, but this time they added a lot more variety. You'll be doing things such as tracking people by their footprints, manning a turret and mowing down everything that moves. You'll be stealthily tailing somebody, but my personal favorite happens to be the on-rails motorcycle scene. から<笑> Ocelot! We're not done yet!
Got you this time.